How is it going, everyone? Yes, welcome, welcome back to, to the, the dome. dome. This time, uh, online again. Because we realized yes. that every time we hang out to record, we record like two videos. <laughs> and since the Let's Play has basically just turned into me playing it, that's what we're doing. So I'm, I'm here at my place at 12.05 a.m. Playing Sunshine while I got, a, got Ramon on a Discord call. Headquarters. Yeah. Got Ramon in, in a Discord call here. I am just chilling. So, last time we completed Olo Serena Beach, so now we gotta do Noki Bay. Your favorite stage. Are you playing Kakarot right now? Yeah, I missed two uh, side missions. Yeah, this man's playing. I wanna have all of them done, so. Like in the main story or in DLC? The DLC. Ooh. The DL6. Did you already complete the main story? Yeah. It's really short, it's just the Bardock special. They didn't add anything to it. Oh yeah, this this mission is cool. So you like shrink down into this uh You shrink down into this bottle and you have to find eight red coins in it. It's kinda similar to the eight red coins thing in uh Mario 64 where you go inside the aqu aquarium. I see, I see. Oh the bottle! Oh what's it gonna about? So we're underwater now, right? With a really cool camera. Mm -hmm. And we gotta get these coins. Uh, now if we get coins, they refill our air. Just like in 64, so... It's not that big a problem. Also, we got like a nice helmet. It's pretty sick. Also, if you touch the, the bottom, you'd like bounce up for some reason. I have no- I have no clue why. Oh, okay, what is the game doing? What? What? No. No, what What are you doing, game? It's like shooting me up. Wait, does it like have to shoot me up there? So you, you do not want those fish to touch you. If it's not incredibly obvious. Mm -hmm. How did I miss it? What the heck? Bro, he's getting cooked. I'm getting cooked on the first stage of the video, bro. There we go, six. Now I got two more to find. Uh, where are they? Where are they? Where? Where are they? Where are they? Bro, the commentary is going to be even more retarded because it's on Discord. <laughs> Viewers, we took the. We already talk very stupid in person. On Discord. <laughs> it's worse. It's worse. It's like a Zenkai boost. What is yeah, where, this? Where's the shine spawn? There we go. Look at that. We already got a shine. Three minutes. Oh yeah. Not as fast as my shine though. Wahoo! Wahoo! My shine was pretty fast. See, it's it's happening. It's happening. All right, we're gonna go back inside. Back inside the Noki Bay. Oh, this is like a boss fight, and it sucks. Because it's an underwater boss fight. Oh, I'm so glad, then. I am glad. So about the other Mario 3D games for Let's Plays. <laughs> <laughs> I actually do want to do a 3D World. That'd be fun with all of us. Oh yeah, 3D World's made for multiplayer. I'm, I'm talking about, like, for you doing, like, the, uh, other, like, games that are in this style, like, 64, Galaxy, Odyssey. Yeah. I think 64 would be fun, because there's the, uh, split-screen hack. Oh, okay. So we can both play. Galaxy already has, like, the two-player mode, kinda. And Odyssey also does. We could also do Bowser's Fury, because 
if you want, we could like switch between Mario and Bowser Jr. Because Bowser Jr. actually get you actually get to like fly around and like do things. Because I know you are um, not very fond of. Uh... Also, watch this. Check this out. That's I think sick. I want to do uh, Luigi's Mansion. You want to really do that? Like you playing it? Yeah. That'd be or it could be me and then me and you and then you. Yeah. Like <laughs> usual. But I think I'd have like more fun doing Luigi's Mansion. Yeah, Luigi's Mansion is like. It's not like this. It's finished. <laughs> and we could, of, yeah. of course, play the actual, like, GameCube version of it. Yes. Because I own it. I also own the GameCube version of this game. Okay. But I've only ever really played it on emulator or on, uh, this collection. Which, by the way, this collection was, like, so disappointing when it came out. I'm pretty sure you already know. Also, yeah, yeah this guy, you have to, like, clean his teeth. It sucks. Because you're underwater, so you have to keep constantly getting coins to get air. And he does this, and you gotta, like, fly upwards, because he's gonna... He's gonna do his thing. You gotta I clean his teeth. I the game. the special. This don't make no sense. Alright, come on. There we go. Yeah, this boss fight is it's not hard, it's just annoying. Because of how long it takes to, uh... To, like... Beat it. Yeah. It's not, it's not even really a boss fight. <laughs> it's more of a dental appointment. But it's a cool idea. Yeah. I'll say that much. I did tell you about, like, the one of the main things that gives away how this game was rushed was that there's a lot of cut content. Like, they played, like, a yeah. lot more worlds than, the, like, the seven that they have in the game. Uh, so, but because they had to rush it, um, the, like, remaining 24 shines, they just turned into the blue coins. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit, I need, I need coins. Speaking of coins, I need some. Hold up. Oh god. I'm, I'm being sucked. No. Yeah, I, I, I don't think I'm a very big fan of this. Of this fight. Bro, I need air. Just come on. Work. Turn around, Mario. Bro, sometimes this Mario just does not turn around. There we go. Okay, we beat him, but like I, I can still die. That's the problem. And his gold tooth turns into a shine. I think. I think so. Yeah. Okay. Easy. You did it, chat. Oh, I got a full. Okay, thank God, it gives me a full uh, heal. See, that's that's actual game design right there. <laughs> it's actual fair game design, Mario Sunshine. Indeed. See, like stuff like sixty four and Galaxy are not this frustrating. I still love this game because, like, I think the biggest thing this game has is the atmosphere. Yes. Definitely. Like, this is definitely a game that you'd play during the summer. For sure. Um, and I do like some of the levels. And I do like, the controls are very, like, when, when they're in a stage where they work, the controls are actually really nice, right? Also, when mm -hmm. you're not playing with Joy-Cons. Like, when you're playing with us, like, you agree with me, right? When you're playing with a Pro Controller, it feels so smooth. You just run around, spin around, jump. Cause like you yeah. got really you got really good at the controls as well. It's the level designs that are just like garbage. <laughs> oh, guess what? It's our uh, favorite guy. 
Oh, hell yeah. Il Pientissimo. Let's go race him. I forget how this race goes, but I'm pretty sure we Bison. can, like... Are you sure we can just, you like... just say Ryson? I said race him. Nah, oh, bro, you definitely said Ryson. I challenge you to race in the flag. Where the fuck is the flag? Oh yeah, you can, you can kind of cheese this. Because, <laughs> like, he can, like... You can just, like, spin off and, like, do this crazy shit. Yeah, you can just, like, do this. <laughs> really hard race, my guy. <laughs> my record's 40 seconds, beats it in 20. <laughs> like, where you at? Yeah, look at you, loser. In fact, you're such a loser. I'm gonna go out and get these blue coins, you bitch. Before you get there. Um, pretty sure you have to get the bolts to use to get these blue coins, but whatever. Damn they it. added um, solid state scouter to Kakarot. Really? Yeah. Wait, the, so the DLC is based on the Bardock OVA? Yeah. Like the original, like Bardock, Father of Goku? Yes. Good. <laughs> That's all I have to say, good. Because if it's episode of Bardock or like Dragon Ball Minus, uh. They could have done episode of Bardock though. That could just be like one mission. Just go Super Saiyan, kill, chill, that's it. Mm hmm. This episode of Bardock is. Like... I want them to do Fusion Reborn. Yes. Fusion Reborn, cooler, even Broly. Uh. Oh. Wrath, of the, Wrath of the Dragon would be fucking awesome, but they're never gonna do that. Cause that would require to like, make a model for uh... What's the vi villain's name again? Fucking... Garn. Garn, yeah. That's not hard though, you fight the great apes in Kakarot, so... I guess so. But still, it's like, it's too short. You know? But like, I, I guess... I don't know. I would like if they did... Like all the movies. Cause if they do cooler, they could just do both movies. Wait, they haven't done uh Super Broly, have they? There's really nothing from Super in this game. They should do Super Broly though, that'd be awesome. Just like a giant super boss against Broly. Yeah. Cause like Resurrection F and Battle Guards are technically Z. I mean so. a Broly fight would be like <laughs> It would be like a three-phase fight. It'll yeah. be like 20 minutes to kill. Oh no, they could also do... Z Broly. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see, just 23rd tournament though? Hell yeah. I love a, that. It's such a good, like, concept for a game though, Kakarot, that is. Just to be like... This big, like, just adaptation of the story to the games. And just like yeah. adding everything. I'm so excited to fight Piccolo Jr., man. Like, One Piece doesn't really have a game like that. Some One Piece games, like the Pirate Warriors games, do that where they adapt the arcs into missions. But it's a pirate. It's a Dynasty Warriors game, so like, it's literally just like. Pack and slash a bunch of enemies in an arena. You can't really do much with that, right? Yeah. But like, I want like a game like Kakarot for One Piece where like each major enemy is like a boss fight. There's like a big open world you can explore, right? You actually get to steer the boat to travel to the destinations, which is something for some reason there you can't do in any of these One Piece games. I mean, I don't know about the new one, Odyssey. I don't know how that one works yet. But I heard people like it. Okay. Because people are saying it's basically, uh... Well, they're saying it's basically, um... Like, Dragon Quest. Mm-hmm. Or Dragon Quest Eleven, I guess. I'm pretty sure it was Bandai Namco that helped to develop that game. 
Actually, yeah. no, I think... No, Bandai Namco uh, made uh, the Tales... the Tales games. Like, Tales of Symphonia, Tales... Fuck! <laughs> Tales of Arise, you know all those games, right? Mm-hmm. So they're capable of making really good, uh... JRPGs. See, I just don't want another, like, anime game made by Spike Chunsoft. Like, uh, like Jump Force. <laughs> See, here's the problem, right? Spike Chunsoft, like, they're good developers, but they're really only good at, like, visual novel type games, right? Mm hmm. Like, obviously, there's Stang and Rampa, but, like, there are other stuff like Zero Escape, the uh, AI Somnium Files, like, those are all pretty good games. Just don't, like, make... Don't make fucking anime action arena games. And it's all good. You know what mm. I'm saying? Cause, like... I don't know. Like, even games like One Piece Burning Blood, like, they're, that's okay. But it's, like, still lacking compared to other, like, arena fighters that I played. Like, probably, like, the best anime... Like, the most consistent, like, anime 3D arena fighters out there is, like, uh, the Naruto Storm games. Mm. And there's also that Kill la Kill game that came out recently that's pretty good as well. Because it, it basically feels like you're playing, like, a 3D, like, Dragon Ball Fighters type of game. Mm -hmm. Also, by the way, this mission sucks. Oh, you're on? Oh, damn. <laughs> Those are oh the best God. missions, bro. This one sucks. Because you have to do wall jumping, but it's like... This game... You know how this game is. I do. Oh my God, he didn't jump. He didn't jump, bro. He didn't jump. He decided like, nah. You know what? I'm good. I'm good this time. You can take it, homie. I'm good. Bro, I want to see Low Tier God talk to this game. And, and tell it to kill itself. <laughs> I made a mistake. Oh! Yeah, you gotta, like, time your jumps there. Wait, I could maybe, like, do that. Oh, shit. Okay, I could, I could definitely do that. Hold on. I'm coming! No! <laughs> that was my fault. He's coming, Chad. Well, I'm down to my last life. And it took me forever to get into the actual stage itself, so that's... That's a good sign. Especially since I don't remember how this stage even works. Okay, maybe I should wait for the next rotation? Thank you. Alright, now let's get this. I'm, 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 I'm already ready to turn this game off. Like, what shine number? We're, like, we already got, we stormed through, like, three shines, right? Like, we have 75 shines right now. I could just end it here. <laughs> <laughs> but we're doing it for you, viewers. The viewers at home. The dumb. I'm suffering for your sake. In this goofy ass stage, I you think this, we'll, is, this think is the we'll hardest one of these two. Hmm. Think we'll ever do merch? Merch dome for the merch. dome. Like, will we sell like dome hats? Dome hats. It's just what would that be? Oh, it's just the dome. I mean. 
fire, bro. Bro, the Dome Dashi collab in like 2025. Ooh. Dome Dashy, freaking Scott the Waz, Berlizzi, <laughs> KSI collab. I think I think we're setting our sights a little bit too high there. All together. All of them in the same room. Yes. Ow. Ow. <laughs> I don't know, I don't, I don't think Dashi would even have the patience for our language. You know what but I'm you saying? Know, um, do you know the game Audio Surf? Audio Surf? Yeah. I know the game Super Mario Sunshine, and I know it's a piece of shit. Oh, but... Audio... It's a, it's a game where... Like... It... It creates a track based on, like, the song you're playing. Oh, I heard of that. Right? But, like, you could put your own music in it. So you could put, like, the Danception originals and just play a game with your songs in it. Yeah. You ever be kinda cool. heard of uh, Monster Rancher on PS PS1? Mm, no. It was, like, a Pokemon-type game, but it would create monsters. It would generate them based on, like like music CDs that you put into the PlayStation. I see. So it's, it's kind of similar. Okay, okay. Of course it was made like back when CDs were still like a big thing. Mm-hmm. Now like who who do you see around here with like soundtrack CDs? Uh or like music CDs that aren't like Collector's items for games or something, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I do like soundtrack CDs as collector's items, though. Mm-hmm. Like, they are pretty cool. Oh, like, God. I do- I have the, uh... The soundtrack CD for Mario Galaxy. Oh, cool. Is pretty nice, and I also have one for Kirby. Like it's like a collection of songs. For the, it's part of the uh, 30th anniversary collection. Oh, I would like one for God of War. They probably exist one. Well, probably they definitely exist one. I want one. I for want three. Bro, look look down at this madness. Oh my god. Okay, Mario, don't fuck up now. Or right at the end, bro. This jump is a little bit crazy, though. Got it. Okay, that wasn't actually that bad. Once I got past that, like, stupid part, the rest of it was actually not, not that hard at all. Because I already know how to deal with this. He's I doing it, chat. You already know the first time I played this, I played it with save states, right? Did you know? Because I played it on uh, an emulator the first time I played it. Back in 2019. 2019. Cheater. And then 2020 I played cheater. it on this. Well, this listen, this this doesn't have save state, so I had to do it legit. That is like... I don't believe it. I'm so upset that this is like the only GameCube game that's ever been ported to the Switch. From like Nintendo. Like, just bring them, please! There's no reason not to. People would buy hey, it. Give me the Crash Bandicoot game that was on GameCube. I mean Crash, uh, what was it called? I don't know. Like... forget the name. I just know there's Wrath a stage Wrath where you're running. Wrath of, Wrath of Cortex. I should get that yes. game. There's a stage where like, you're running like, from a dragon. It's pretty cool. It's still a full Crash game, right? It's like... I think so, yeah. It's a very divisive game, like, it's very mixed reception. That's why, like, when they made the uh, Crash 4, like, the new one, they just called it Crash 4. Because <laughs> they're like, yeah, just forget about this one. Mm-hmm. I wish they could do that for Sonic 4. And just call Sonic Mania Sonic 4. 
Because the actual Sonic 4 is so, like, it's just so mid. <laughs> like, Sonic 4 Episode 2 is actually not that bad. I actually do like some of the stuff in it. Like, I like how you fight Metal Sonic multiple times. And there's, like, a race with him on, like, a roller coaster track in, like, a winter, like, amusement park. Hmm. Like, that's kind of cool, right? Yeah. 100% in, like, getting all achievements in both of the episodes was not cool. <laughs> but it was short, so... I can't really complain too much about doing that, because it was my choice. Mario, what are you doing? Where's he? Where's he? What's he cooking? <gasps> oh my god. I fell all the way to the bottom, are you kidding me? Well, we gotta climb back up. But I got the I got the sick movement, so I'm good. See, look at that. Oh my god, where's he going? Bro, this dude is not moving shit. I haven't hit him once, like up here. Where's he going? Okay, now he's just gonna jump off again. Never mind, he's still going upwards. Oh, wow, is that... Oh my god, what? Let me hit you! Oh my god, bro. There we go, I caught him. Alright. <laughs> Shadow <laughs> Mario is mine. He's a bitch. What would you call Shadow Mario in real life if you saw him? Black Mario. Okay, <laughs> whoa. Whoa there, buddy. No, like, Goku Black. Oh. Black Mario. The same. Just call him Mario Dragon Black. Dragon Ball then. reference. We'll call Mario, him Mario Black. Black. Yeah. Yeah, I'm watching you. Zamasu. He's just Zamasu, bro. I mean, it's Bowser Jr. in disguise. Oh! Spoilers! Oh, I'm sorry, but we already saw the cutscene like 15 episodes ago. No, nah, bro, that's, you're spoiling the, the game for everybody. But they should have watched that episode already. Like, it's like skipping to season 4, episode 5 of Breaking Bad and complaining about spoilers. Like, whoa, why is it spoiling? Why is it spoiling season 2? Oh, Shadow, he just looks like Metal Mario. From Mario Kart. Well, he has red eyes, though. Terminator. It's Terminator Mario. That's I'm calling it Terminator Mario. That's what he is. <laughs> What's his model number? Like... T... T... Like, 1200? Uh... Well... March 15th translates to 0315, right? Or no, March 10th translates to 03110, or 10, right? His model yeah. number is T0310, because March 10th, if you write it as M-A-R-1-0, reads like Mario. Yeah, you got it. Alright, okay. we got another red coin mission. Instead, this is this entire area. This one could be a little bit tricky because a lot of these red coins are in like hard spot places. I don't know. But it's kind of chill. As long as you keep your air up. As long as you keep your air up. I have to repeat that. This area is also really good for getting uh, 100 coins. Like this is the mission you get to, to do 100 coins. Hmm. Weirdly enough, I don't know why, but the red coins in this game don't give you coins. Oh, I remember what this is now. You just go, you get the uh, fish. But like when you get near it, it like splits apart. It's weird. See? 
Mm-hmm. So it's not that bad. I'm probably thinking about, like, the one that takes forever is the, uh, 100 coins. This is fucking fish, like, it's kind of fast. It's not as bad as that Coral Reef one, though. The one that they hated. Mm -hmm. Oh, Guys, splitting apart again. Okay, cool. Damn, I wish... I, w I wish I could just, play, you know, play as with Gohan, you know, like... In, uh... In what? Oh, that that's like music to my ears. Oh my god. Just hearing, like, the, the ring for getting the red coins back and forth. Oh, Incredible. you know... What came out today? Hmm? The, um, new trailer for Mandalorian Season 3. Yeah. Looks pretty sick. I am excited. Oh, give it to me. There we go. Got it. Oh, you know what's weird? What? It feels like the year, well, the year just started, and yet it's already the 17th. Yeah, we, we're already about to get a... Like, the the way I can tell, like, wow, this month went by so fast is when, like... We already have another Dragon Ball Super chapter. Yeah. You know the I'm way like, I can think damn. of? Like, what? we're getting a new Ant-Man movie in less than a month. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Like, pre-orders already, like, gang. went up today. We're definitely gonna That's go see still it. That's wild, though. I'm just not super excited for the movie, because, like, the visual effects don't look great. I, like, I just want to see the movie for Kang. That's, like, all yeah, I care about. me too. I only care about Kang. Because it's the first time we're gonna see Kang since fucking Loki, which was a year and a half ago. Like, Jesus. Yeah. Bro, I'm so I just I want to see Kang cook. He better cook in this movie. He's cooking. I swear. Also, I'm going back in the secret to get the red coin mission, but thankfully, we have flood this time. Hmm. And then we'll do the village, which the village is actually pretty easy. I remember watching back some of the recordings of like the village stage. Uh and you were racing the guy up the tree? Mm hmm No, I was racing him, and I beat him. And I jumped over the ledge past the flag, and died. <laughs> Damn. If that isn't a Danception moment, I don't know what is. Bro. What would you classify as the definition of a Danception moment? That's tough. It's, it's like something just like something that that's that's like oh man like you're not dumb enough to do that or uh, what are the odds of that happening and then it <laughs> happens right after you yeah know? that's a deception <laughs> moment basically every five minutes playing uh grand theft auto 5. Like, oh he'll never you know Boost like, that perfect like angle to land blown, in the pool. <laughs> have I blown your mind playing that game? <laughs> like, I think I've done things I've never seen in that game before. Bro, you've, you've shown me things I didn't think was possible. Listen, maybe I'm like the perf- I would be like the perfect speedrunner for like, finding glitches. Yeah. I'll just be like, oh, let me, uh, let me just do this, like, really dumb thing. And, like, suddenly, like... See, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> God, this mission sucks, because it's, like, camera! Hello! God, the time limit's a little bit strict on this one. God. 
Oh, we gotta do GTA 4 online one day. Oh, totally. Cause like, we're just gonna do the entire thing, like... Just gonna do the entire stream at the, uh... <laughs> at you know where. Nah, no, there's, there's things to do. Oh god. 30 seconds to do this, I'm not gonna make it. Not when I have two points left to get 20 seconds. I'll have to activate God Gamer Mode! It's over. I missed that jump, it's over. Wait. Wait. I did it. Holy shit. You saw that, right? He did it. Did you see that? He did it. Or you, you're playing crack. You're playing crack around. I'm, I forgot. No, I'm I'm done. I did everything. I 100% of the game again. Now all I need to do is actually make it to the shine, which was <laughs> it was I was a little bit uh Worried because I didn't have that much water left. All right, but that's all the shines in uh in Noki Bay. Let's do one more for the video. Yeah, let's do one more. <laughs> okay, so well, technically we still have to do hundred coins, but we can do that a little bit later. Now we got uh, Pianta Village. Pianta. Piñata. Did you ever do piñatas? Growing I up? I did, and I smacked the shit out of someone in the leg. <laughs> that always <laughs> happens. Literally, like, every single time a piñata thing ever happens. A piñata party. But I only remember, like, two. I think Bro, I had, I like, an Optimus Prime one and, like, a Ninja Turtle I remember one. I had a birthday party. It was, like, my ninth birthday. And we did a piñata. And I invited some kids from my class. And this one fuck-ass kid, I forget his name. <laughs> with the... <laughs> I'm sorry, the way I described him. <laughs> fuck-ass. <laughs> no, but this fuck-ass kid. Like, when the moment, like, the piñata broke, he dove. And like spread his arms and like he like opened his shirt and like scooped it all up. Hey man. That's that's just being smart. Like he was cooking. He was cooking with that one, but like man, did I ever want to just like grab my baseball, my metal baseball, and just crack his jaw. Yeah, bro, he was being a fuck ass. A <laughs> fuck ass. <laughs> oh, I wish I remembered his name. So I could dox him. Oh, his name was probably like, like, like Parker. Parker. Yeah, or like Ebenezer. <laughs> Ebenezer. Yeah. Bro, if a kid nowadays was named Ebenezer. I knew a kid named Ebenezer in grade three. Life is over. Oh yeah, look what happens Dude, at the I... start of this mission. <laughs> it's not like that though. So we have to do this, right? Mm. We have to do this without flood. We have to make it to like the center and grab the shine. Problem is, there's like all this, like, lava that we cannot spray away. Because we don't have flood on us. There's a way to cheese it, though, but I'm not gonna even try. Actually, you know what? Let's tempt fate. Oof. Boy, he's in the orange crush. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh. <gasps> no! <gasps> Rob like on life support right now. Holy shit. Yeah, how do I do this? I jump, yeah, okay, not attack, it's jump. I gotta remember that because we fucked up before on this. Bro, we're on life support. We You're still part of the let's play. 
I'm even I'm enjoying I... some chocolates. Oh yeah, I, you know what I did today? What? I finished the jug of chocolate milk. Oh. I finished that yesterday. Your second one? Yeah. How do you do that? I don't understand. Well, it's just... I've trained my body. It's a hundred, like a hundred grams of sugar total in one of those. So? Oh. What do you mean so? Bro, I had it with two waffles. That doesn't make it better. <laughs> Listen, I'm trying to help you out here, okay? It's a, it's a serious addiction. It's, it's just like, it's just like my, uh, fucking addiction to Baja Blast. I don't know. Actually, if anything, I probably drink more Dr. Pepper than Baja Blast. Bro, you don't, you don't get it. I've been having those, those jugs of mini jugs since I was like 10. Like... 10, 8 years old. Yeah, well, that, that still doesn't make it better. I'm just saying, like, I've been training. But you can't just, like... You my know, my body knows, like, oh, he's about to drink... You can't just, like, have, like, like, half of it or, like, something? I'm sometimes I do. Sometimes I have half, and then, like, later in the day I'll have the rest. Bro, I seriously don't know where I'm going. I could probably make it to that, but like I'm not gonna risk it when like I'm literally one one hit away. I did risk it and I died. <laughs> I forget how to do uh, this mission, honestly. Shout out to Glenn on Facebook Marketplace. Oh yeah, Glenn. Let's go, Glenn. He did tell me when when I got it. He's like, "Go oh, tell your friends about me." And I saw games and stuff. I was like, "Bet." On the dome. Ask him if he has. Glenn. Ask him if he has Professor Layton in the Astrum Legacy. If he does have that, I'll hit him up. Give him like a hundred dollars. Sure, I'll give him like a hundred dollars for it. Hear that, Glenn? Give, I'm offering you a hundred bucks. On the dome. Come on, the dome. I'll give you a hundred bucks for Professor Layton in the Astrum Legacy. Even though the game's worth like 150, you don't have to worry about that. Because I'm willing to pay up front and personal. Bro, I'm so excited about level 5 coming back. Mm-hmm. Like, they're a really good developer. Oh yeah, you know, you want to know a little bit of like a, a funny thing you can do? What? You can actually splash water from jumping out of the, uh, out of the river and splash it onto the, uh, the lava to make it go away. Oh, well, that's pretty smart. Also, ooh, a blue coin in here. <laughs> so I'm gonna try that method instead. I was trying to go under under the uh, underneath the village, but that's not gonna work with the way mm. I do things. So let's try this method. I don't remember where we're supposed to go, but we will make it eventually. Oh Jesus! So we have to like we have to like jump out and spray the water like that. See, and it kind of works. Cause like we're like wet for a little bit. <laughs> this is so cheap. Hmm. But like, I won't let sunshine beat me. Oh, Jesus. Okay, okay, chill. Chill. I'm sorry. Okay, just a little bit more and we'll be, probably be able to, like, hop our way through. Oh, God, it's coming back. 
All right, this is going to be risky. It was risky. We made it back, though. So. Oh, Jesus. Um... I'm in danger! <laughs> God, I got too close. Okay, what else can I do here? I don't want to do it the legit way because I don't want this game to beat me. I've already... I've already made my choice. I made my choice, you make yours. How much farther can I spread this out? Oh, I'm dead. I, 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 I dead. I dead. Yeah, remember that iCarly episode? I dead? Yeah. I want some, like, some nachos right now, bro. Nachos? Yeah. Oh, you know what I'm gonna drink after this recording? What? I got some McDonald's Coke in the fridge. Ooh. My sister got me it because they work at McDonald's, so they get free drinks. I guess it's kind of cool, free drinks. Yeah, unfortunately, working at McDonald's stinks. <laughs> yeah. That's the McDonald's experience, folks. Indeed. You know, I could probably do it from here. McDonald's? No, like... The, the jumping strategy. Oh, like, okay. Because I have to get there to do this. Problem is, like, you can't jump that high. I would have to do a triple jump and land on that box, but that seems like crazy. You know what I mean? Hmm. It's all about finding alternate methods, viewers. Remember, viewers, sometimes the easiest solution is the last thing on your mind. Exactly. Yeah. Shoutouts to, uh... The dashy experience points. <laughs> mm-hmm. Also, you can't always be alright when some of you is left. Wh what does that mean? I don't know. But... I almost made it... Oh my god, I'm dead. I almost made the jump, and I game over it. Well, eh. bro, have you seen like people wearing Crocs recently? That's a, that's a surprise. Yeah, I mean, Crocs were always the thing. I know, like I know, but like, like. Like to the mall. Oh no. And shit. Like I see, like, cause like when I take the bus, it's at the, like at the mall. So like, I see people wearing Crocs a lot. I don't know why. I, don't know. I, see, I see it. It's like, okay, Crocs. Well, like. Have you ever seen the picture? Big, uh... Have you ever seen the picture of Crocs that are filled with beans? Bro, I've seen a lot of pictures of Crocs filled with stuff. <laughs> Crocs filled with mayonnaise. Bro, but like, I, I'm not a big Croc enjoyer. What are your favorite types of shoes then? Oh, junklas, bro. I love junklas. My favorite. I'm okay with them. I just have trauma. <laughs> Did your mom hit you with chunklas? Yes. Damn, I never got that. Or did I? No. 
See, you're. Did I? No, I didn't. I don't think. See, you're not Mexican though. You're from. You're Chilean. True. I got. I got hit with like. Oh, yep. I figured it out. Look at this. <laughs> oh, right, chocolate is the best. Look at that. Oh god, but there's lava on top of that. Really? Yeah, where do I get flood back from then? Oh, boom, boom, boom. It's over. Fine. Boom. <laughs> I don't remember where I go. Okay, I'm gonna look this up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, viewers. Uh, Mario Sunshine, Goofy Bruno. Yeah, I don't know how to tease this. Bro. And where? I'm supposed to go like underneath where? the areas, but like... Man, nobody does that. Oh, I see a way I can Jesus. Okay. I found the path. The victory, Ramon. He did it. I haven't done it yet. He's gonna do it. I'm gonna, not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. Bro, that's like the best actor I've ever heard in my life. That guy from the racist orphan video. Yeah, it's almost like he might have meant it. <laughs> it's almost like he's been holding. He's like, I've been holding this one in for years. <laughs> Bro, the video's not fake. It's 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 real. Yeah, wait, that's not um. What's it called? Uh, it's not Darman. Yeah, it's not Darman. It's uh, the other one. Oh shit. You can do that? What the hell? I didn't know that was a thing. It just made a fucking tree appear. Holy shit, Marty. <laughs> I turned that tree. Oh fuck. Yeah, that's what I get. <laughs> that's what I deserve. Yo, actually, do I even know where I'm, what I'm doing? Yeah, I do. It's there, right? Because there's the hole there. Yeah. Yeah, that's where I'm trying to go. That's what I'm trying to see. I figured out the method. I've taken a few hits though, that's the problem. Alright, I might be able to make it like this way. I just need like a good spin jump and I'm fucking going. Okay, I'm gonna stop that guy before he does anything foul to me. This must be very entertaining, viewers, to watch me spin jump a million times. Okay, I could probably make this jump. Oh god. I'm gonna get scared last minute about it. Oh, Jesus Christ. No! Because these enemies keep showing up. They're ruining my style. Bro, can these guys stop spawning? What the hell just hit me? It's over. Damn it, bro, bro, bro. I'm going to- I'm going at like... 
I'm gonna drop a diss track on you, Mario. Stupid Fario, my Cario, in your drive Ario, about to run over your kids Ario with my car Ario. God damn it, bro. Ramon, you cooking right now? You cooking some. Yes. Some bacon, egg, and cheese? Bacon, egg, and cheese. <laughs> I could go for a bacon, egg, and cheese right now. Could you go for a, uh. A Wimpy's Diner breakfast? Bacon, egg, and cheese? Wimpy's Diner breakfast. Well, if we had, if we had bacon, I would make a bacon, egg, and cheese. We should. On a every try... bagel. We should try One Piece Diner again next time. Sure, it's just kind of pricey. Well, it's just, <laughs> yeah. Let's go on a day where we both get paid. So we can like order anything but poutine and hot dog. We could get a bacon and cheese. Oh. Can I make that? Oh. I can try. Well, I tried. Okan Battle V Jump. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna be safe with this one. Okay, I I think that confirms what eighth anniversary is gonna be. Bro, these guys are trying to snipe me. Oh my god. Bro, I'm, I'm being sniped right now, because there's shit tripping from the top. Like, it's dripping just like Goku! <laughs> this is, like, not the right way to do this, by the way. You're supposed to, like, do, like, a maze down on the ground, but I don't, I don't like doing that way. I mean, this is not that much better, but at least I don't have to do a freaking stupid maze. I just like as best as I'm gonna get it. No! I fucking killed myself because I'm an idiot. I'm a. Oh my god. God. You know I'm pissed off when I start singing the fucking Mario Sunshine tap. I did it. I made it. You now I just gotta chat. not mess up. It gets my flood pack. Give it to me. Give it to me. Oh. Oh. It's a blue coin. That's the reward for all that. Now, now we can actually do the mission. Where, where do I go for this anyway? Has, uh, has Jeremy responded yet? <laughs> no. He hasn't responded to me yet. Jeremy responding? To anything? There we go, that's how we get it. We have to clean this guy. Oh, we can finally end this video now that we're at 80. Because that's a nice number, right? 80 is good. 80 I is like nice. 80. Yes. Indeed. Alright, viewers. That's going to be it for this video. We'll see you guys in the next one where we finally finish Piata Village.